Oh, shit. Oh, child. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Vinia McKell. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Today is part two of my weekend shopping during Bath and Body Works in my annual sale. If you haven't seen part one, it's already posted. Go check it out. Um, I found some gems. I found some jewels. I was out of town. And you know, if you still saw my semi-annual sale tips and tricks video, I always, always, always recommend if you're in a different city, go check out their Bath and Body Works because they have different selection. They have different things that your store might not have. So I took advantage of that. And there was some stuff from Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret. Go check it out. Today's video is semi Bath and Body Works had 20% off. They sent an email, 20% off. Um, of in store and online and I said well can't pass that up I did I bought a lot like I did but in my defense about 75% of the things in here are actually not for me they are for other people that is the only saving grace but my thumbnail is misleading because I only show one bag but in reality I have the bag that's in a thumbnail as well as three other bags. So get yourself a snack. Get yourself a little glass of water, glass of wine, whatever your pleasure, because we're gonna be here for a little minute. Thank you to all my beautiful new subscribers. I'm telling you, we slowly but surely grown. We're going up there. If you see this, I'm on the road to a thousand subscribers. Am I close? No. But that doesn't mean I can't strive and set goals for myself. Also, after a thousand subscribers, I am eligible to be monetized. So I felt like that was just a good goal for me to work towards and strive towards. So, without further ado, let's get into it. So, one of the first things, it was so crazy. As soon as I walked in the store, I saw this and I immediately, immediately called my god sister. Because this was on the table that was $5.95. And when I show you this, you're going to be like, this was on the table with what? For how much? I immediately called her. But, this is when I knew that this trip was gonna bless me right here saltwater breeze and the perfume was on the table for five dollars and 95 cents i'm not even a salt saltwater breeze girl but when i seen that i said oh this is gonna bless me so i called her immediately and she said oh give me two of those so that's what I did. I got her two saltwater breeze and the perfume for $5.95 plus the 20% off. How can you pass that up? How? Tell me how I'm supposed to walk past it. You can't. So this is for her. Also on that same table, that same table from a couple weeks ago in my first huge SAS day one video, that table, all the stuff, all the candles were $8. And I ended up, I got about four candles. Because I said $8 with my 20% off coupon. I had an actual coupon at the time. I said that come down to like $6.40. That's pretty much the same as 75% off. So I got like four candles. Today, those candles were also $5.95. Three wick candles for $5.95 plus my 20% off. How was supposed to leave it? How? I didn't. So let's get into the candles I got. These first two are for my friend. I remember we went to Bath and Body Works. I think this was last year. And she liked this candle. But it was like $12 or $13. And we both was like, uh-uh. We not paying that. So went on about our day. Didn't think twice about it. This was literally last year. Seen this today and I, for $5.95. When I instantly, I didn't even call her. I just grabbed her two of them. Because I was like, I know she going to want these. So... These two are for her. Then I got another champagne toast. You saw this in my first haul. Christmas packaging. Don't care. Whew. Smells great every time. Strawberry pound cake. And a three wick. For $5.95. I have. I had two of these. I went through one of them. I think I still have one left. But now I can use the other one freely. It does what it's supposed to do in the body care. And the candles they did their thing when it came to the strawberry pound cake I got another champagne toast I mean 
There's nothing to say about it. I got another one. It is what it is. Hmm. Got another champagne toast. So I have three today. I think I had two from the last time. So I have a total of five. No regrets. Got another strawberry pound cake. And a three whip. I got a kiwi passion fruit. Oh, I should have got another one of those. And I got one of these for myself. And you know that I have this in the body care. If you see my project use it up. I actually think it might be better in the candle than it is in the body care. Because this, this does smell really, really good. And I'm not as motivated to use the body care. But I'm very excited to like this. Those are all the candles that I got. And I feel like I should have gotten more. Because $5.95? For three wick candles plus another 20 percent off i was also on the phone with my god sister and i know she loves salt water breeze so much i seen the shower gel she's like oh, okay go ahead give me two of those so i got her two shower gels so i'll be shipping off her stuff and two perfumes two shower gels i think i got her a gingham body wash in my last haul so she'll get a nice little collection of things she also had me on the hunt for some soaps for a family friend of hers. So they literally had a table full of soaps, hand soaps for $2. I got her Vanilla Cloud, Blackberries and Basil, Orange and Ginger. Why didn't I think about this? I think Erin liked that one. Whoops. Gingham in the hand soap, which I didn't even know they had this in hand soap. Strawberry pound cake in the hand soap. I think I got her two of those. Yep, another one here. French lavender. Autumn rainfall, I think this is. Um... Chamomile and bergamot. And eucalyptus and tea. Out of all of those soaps, none of them are for me either. If you remember from my first haul, I found this in the shower gel and the spray. But I didn't find it in the body cream. But remember I said, that doesn't mean I won't eventually find it. And what happened today? I found champagne sprinkles and the body cream. If you know me, you know I jumped on the champagne sprinkles train very late. I was not into it last year. Then I ended up smelling it on somebody, and I was like, what is that? And then I smelled it again. I was like, mm, that's great. Why didn't I get that? My palette and my nose has evolved as I've been doing more body care fragrance content. My nose has really evolved, and I'm able to pick up things. And I was just like, this is actually really great. This is... Sparkling champagne, raspberry icing, and rainbow sprinkles. And now I have the whole set, and I couldn't be happier. Oh, no regrets about that. This is for me. This is for me. <laughs> In my last, my first, this is the first one, day one. Um, I picked up this scent in the body cream and I didn't really have anything else to match it with. I just got it because everybody was like hyping it up. And I was like, well, I want to be in the hype too. So I got it. And then today I went and they had it in the body scrub. So I picked up sweet whiskey in the body scrub. So at least now I have something else that matches it. And I literally think this was $3. I think this was on a $3 table. Plus my 20% off. I just want y'all to remember that everything I got today, I'm naming the prices sans the 20% off. So $3 for this plus 20% off. So this set is for my sister as I'm delving more into like body care content and like learning terminology and phrases. I've been figured out that she loves gourmand things. Sweet, edible, cakey, donut, whatever. It smells like food. She wants it. So I got her a strawberry pound cake in the shower gel. I got it in the uh, body cream. And then I also got it in the spray. I think she's literally going to go through this so quick. I probably should have got her a backup because I think she's really, really going to love this. Also got her this uh, in the body cream. This is Coconut Candy Apple. I didn't spray it. I just literally said the name on the phone with her. And, and she was like, I'll take it. And I was like, I don't know what it smells like. She was like, it doesn't matter. I was like, okay, girl. This is Coconut Candy Apple. They did not have the shower gel. But she said she would make it work. So make it work, sis. This 
um, is fresh coconut colada in the spray. This I only got it in the spray. I still have the shower gel. I still have a body cream and I think a backup in the body lotion. But my spray was down very, very low. So I just picked this up by itself. I don't have it in this packaging. I have it in the newer packaging. But it literally smells the same as the original. So this is for when I, I'm literally one shower away from being empty of this. So refill of that. So I've literally been seeing this on Instagram and, and TikTok. And I'm like, why did my store not have this? Where is it? It is the only form of this. They don't have it anywhere else. But I looked up. It was on the $3 table of all places. I didn't smell it. I just grabbed it. I, I was, I've been influenced. It happens. I fall for the hype all the time. Wouldn't be, it's not going to be the first time. Wouldn't be the first time. Certainly won't be the last. Okay? Mint chocolate swirl. Baby, I don't know what it smells like and I don't care. I just didn't want to miss out. I didn't want to miss out. It smells like exactly what it says. Mint chocolate swirl. There's not even any fragrance notes on this. I think wouldn't it be this kind? I think this be the like the Canadian, um, Canadian release, and they send it over here. First of all, I'm so sorry for talking with gum in my mouth. I said it in the last video that I had gum in my mouth, and I still haven't gotten it out. So I guess I'm just being trifling today but anyway because the last time vanilla rainbow confetti something like that was in this packaging but it was a canadian release and we didn't get it over here we got it only in like the shower gel and the lotion we didn't get too many sprays so there was nothing else to match it there was no shower gel there was no lotion but now i'm included in the hype so now i'm an official content creator <laughs> Also got my sister this set and I almost didn't because I was finna be a hater because I didn't want her smelling like me but she don't live where even close to where I live so I was like okay you can have it too. So love cotton candy champagne. Again anything that smells like food. Gourmand this is rosé strawberry pink sugar. This might be too sweet for her. I told her to try it out see if she likes it. If she don't like it send it back because this is my favorite. Um, I also got it in the body cream and then I got it for her in the cotton candy champagne and the fine fragrance mist i do she's either gonna love it or hate it this is one that's not in between um because it's leaning closer to the still like smelling like a baked good i think she'll like it but it might be too sweet for her we'll see if she doesn't like it i'll have backups of love not that i need any but i'm not gonna turn her down so this was on the $3.95 table. You know, as soon as it say anything other than 75% off, I immediately look away. But I remembered I had my 75% off. Nope, that's not right. I had my 20% off coupon. So I indulged in the 75. Mm -mm, I indulged in the $3.95 table. Can I talk today or no? So I got the pink pineapple sunrise in the body wash. This is $3.95. Also got it in the shower gel. I got it in the lotion i don't think that's coming up there it is in the lotion and then i went ahead and got it in the fine fragrance mist so now i have a full set of that i was waiting for the price to come down and it came down enough that i was willing to participate like i said once my 20 percent came off came down i think it's almost maybe a little cheaper than 75 percent off possibly let me do the math well am i 316 so I think in terms of maybe the spray and the maybe the spray ended up being cheaper because the spray is sixteen fifty. Everything else is thirteen fifty. So either way, I came out the same as semi annual sale prices. So no complaints for me out of that. I picked up a couple of minis. I got um, Dahlia in the spray. Which I pretty much always bring Dahlia when I'm going out of town. Because it's just one that I know is always going to get me compliments. I got it um, in the also the travel size body cream. I actually picked up two of these. Because I travel, I go through body creams quicker than I go through spray. I got Gingham Love in the body cream and the spray travel size. I do have the full size of this one. But... You know, I'm trying to be more intentional about my minis. My minis that I currently have now are sporadic. They're everywhere. Nothing really matches. I just be randomly grabbing stuff. So I'm trying to be more intentional when I'm grabbing my minis and get, like, stuff that at least I have two forms of something. 
Um, this isn't for me. I think my friend's niece was asking about this, and I seen it, and I said I might as well pick it up. She asked for red velvet. There's nothing Bath and Body Works has that's red velvet. Let's just talk about Forever Red. Now that I think about it, she said red velvet. Awesome. Uh, only thing I know that has velvet in it is velvet sugar. So I just picked this up for her. She'll send it off to her um, in the mail. Hopefully she like it. If not. The wear it anyway. <laughs> you know I'm not a saltwater breeze girl, but the way I, these fresh scents have been getting me, I was like, I'll also pick it up too. I got the saltwater breeze in the new packaging, and the shower gel as well as the spray. They were actually all out of the lotions. Um, in saltwater breeze, they didn't have any lotion or any body cream. Um, but I was like, okay, that's fine. I got the shower gel and the spray. And then since I was there, I said, well, I might as well pick up one per perfume for myself. So I got Saltwater Breeze and the perfume for myself. That is everything that I got. As you saw, a lot of things were not for me. Um, I would have spent significantly less if I had only shopped for myself. But that's just what I'd be doing. I'd be seeing stuff for people and I'd be like, ooh, so-and-so like this. Ooh, so-and-so like this. And then I just how I'd be buying a bunch of stuff. So... I have to pack all this up, wrap it. When I ship stuff off like body care, I be wrapping it. I do saran wrap, then I do bubble wrap, and I put packing peanuts in the box. I do not play when it comes to body care, shipping it in the mail. I don't got time to play no games. I am very thorough when it comes to shipping out packages. So, that's what I'll be doing over the next couple of days is getting this stuff prepared to be shipped off. That is everything that I got. I'm super excited with the sale. I did everything with the sale that I thought that I was going to do. Sans a couple of miscellaneous things. I really think this is probably everything that I'm going to get from this. No, I just lied. Because I do want Firecracker Pop and I do want that new Watermelon Blast. But they still hold on to that 50% off and I'm not paying that. Even with if I would have still got the 20% off that, it still was too high. It still was too high. Let me calculate how much it would have been. I just want them to come down off that price. How much is that firecracker pop? Because online right now, I think it's like $6.75 for that stuff. Plus another 20% off. That's still $5.40. I ain't paying it. Come down off that price. Come down up off that price. Bath and body work. So, if they come down off that price and there's a full set of pink watermelon, what's it, watermelon burst, watermelon blast, firecracker pop, and I think that's it. So hopefully I won't be coming back with any more huge hauls. Um, this should be the last big haul. But I said that about the last one. And look, here we are. So um, those $5.95 candles though. If I go back for anything, it'll be that. I'm willing to still pay $5.95 even without 20% off. Even without 20% off. I just feel like you when you see 595 candles, you're supposed to stock up. I've never seen 595 three with candles at Bath Mighty Ricks ever. Child, I'm just rambling. Love y'all so much. Thank you for all my new subscribers. Thank you so much. I love y'all. Love you. I love you. Okay, bye.